it's just not a good idea for that many people to be close to each other right now. We ask people to use common sense. That means events that bring together more than 100 people in a single room or a single confined space at the same time without room to spread out. It means events outside the normal course of daily life. Parades or festivals, gatherings in auditoriums, stadiums, or conferences. It does not mean normal operations at airports, offices, hospitals, restaurants, grocery stores, or other retail establishments. What we are trying to achieve here is the kind of social distancing that experts tell us is critical to stopping the spread of the virus. We all want to end this pandemic. And everything we hear from the experts tells us that slowing its spread is critical to keeping more Virginians healthy and ensuring what we do does not overload our health care system. So I urge Virginians, particularly those in places where there are known outbreaks, such as the peninsula, to please stay home. If you're going to a crowded bar or a large church full of people, I would urge you to rethink those plans. Ask yourself if it's really that important that you go out right now. Social distancing now can save lives later. These are critical steps to reduce and slow the spread of this virus. We don't want folks to panic, but we do want them to plan and to be prepared. And that, that those goals continue. And as the governor has indicated, that means social dis distancing. And we're continuing to refine that as indications, as uh, conditions on the ground uh, demand it. So my comment to the, to the public is to, again, take this seriously. Um, it is, uh, as we're seeing in this country and in seeing in Europe, uh, as we've seen in other countries, it, it, it has serious consequences to individuals. People have died in Virginia from this. People have died in Washington State and other areas around the country. And that our best defense is prevention and the hand washing, the social distancing, staying home when you're sick, avoiding unnecessary travel out into, into the uh, public square. So I, I hope uh, that the message is coming across that this is indeed very serious and we're seeing the evidence of that and the governor's response and the response of the federal government is showing how serious the, the country is taking, the, taking this as it should. Thank you.